Joe, J-O-E, Walden, W-A-L-D-E-N, okay? Uh, I grew up the poor white kid. Uh, so, you know, you can look at me as whatever color you want, but I can tell you early on that what a free box of cheese looks like from the government. I can tell you what a free box of butter looks like from the government. I can tell you what it's like to go to junior high with, hole, with holes in your shoes and the soles and stepping around puddles when it rains. I can also tell you that I learned all through that that my success depended upon me and what I was going to learn and how I was going to walk through life. There was, we were given equality of education, not equity of education. Our success was dependent upon ourselves, not social justice warriors or social justice or anything like that. The world has never been one of social justice. If you want to, if you want to talk social justice, it's in the 70s it was affirmative action, where we were walked into a room and asked if we were white, black, Indian, or Asian Pacific Islander. I knew the people who were doing the questioning, so I kind of kidded with them a bit, and I says, well, I want to be an Indian. Well, you can't. Why not? Because you don't have a tribe member. Okay, I want to be black. Can't. Why not? Well, look at you. You're white. Come on. Give, it a, give us a break. So that started a downward spiral of social justice, of bringing some people up, putting some people down in order to achieve equity. There was no such thing as equity. 45 years later, we're back at it again. Except now we call it diversity, inclusion, get your term. Basically, it's putting some people down, bringing some people up so we can achieve equity. Success is of the individual, and it's on the individual. Tonight, I've heard a number of things from, I happen to sit over here in this row of social justice warriors <laughs> over here. So, and, and okay, you're impassioned, and I'm, I'm fine with that. But there's the other side of it, it's called reality, and your success is dependent totally upon you. Now, what I'm hearing is, oh, and by the way, just over here, uh, do you know that blacks owned slaves and Indians owned slave, slaves? That's history, so that's real history, and I, I can prove it. Now, so, but here again, we're in your, I've heard all of social justice, but the bottom line is, where are you actually looking at the kids to teach them how to survive past high school because once they step into that world and I don't care if they go to ISU, Heartland or whatever success is going to be totally upon them so let's move away from and maybe it's the topic but let's not dwell so much on social injustice but let's look at the kids <laughs>